Hello everyone, thank you for joining Remote Sensing and GIS question and answer session series. In today's question, we'll see how we can able to download the global coral relief and mangrove shapefile data for the whole world. So this is an image showing the coral reef and I'm also having the shapefile data which showing the coral relief for the whole world. And also this is a mangrove data. So how we can able to download this kind of shapefile for the whole world that we are going to see. So like if I'll on the map, this is the base map. And if I'll zoom the place, So now you can able to see the coral reef shape file is showing here, this border. Okay. So in the Andaman and Nicobar, there is a coral reefs. So also if you see the mangroves is also there. So this is the mangrove data. So how we can able to get this kind of shape files that we're going to see today. So for that, you just need to visit Google and search here, global mangrove watch global mangrove watch you will see the data set details global mangrove watch from 1996 to 2020 so just click on the link i will provide the link in the description box from where you can able to access this so now you can able to see in the ocean data viewer these are the global mangroves okay so this blue color indicating mostly maintained whatever the previous if you click on the plus icon, you can able to zoom the place. Okay. So this is the maintained and some lost mangroves are there in the red color. So if you'll see the red color there, so it will see where is the red color. So here is the red color. Okay. So this red color indicating the loss and this is the gain mangrove. So this is for the whole world. How we can able to download this shape file? So if you'll see here, the link is given there to download. So from 1996, there is a year wise, you can able to download 2007, 8, 19. So you can just need to click here. Once you'll click here, it will start automatically download below. So you can read the information, this paper, which goes along with the data sets available. So you can read the more information about this data. So you can read more information about here. That is a global mangrove watch and all this information is given here. So this global mangrove has generated a global baseline map of mangroves for 2010 using Alice Pulsar and Landsat optical data. So they have used Landsat and Alice Pulsar data and changes from this baseline for epoch between 1996 to 2002 derived from Jerry's one sir, Alice Pulsar. So you can read more information is given there. Now, suppose you want to download coral reef. So you can click on the ocean data viewer. Once you'll click on the ocean data viewer, there is a global distribution of coral reef is there. Okay. Then global distribution of cold water corals is there. Then most of the information is given there. Then global distribution of salt marsh you can download. Then there are many information is tidal flat ecosystem. So you just need to click on it. Like suppose you want to download the coral ribs. You just click on the coral ribs and view data set option is there. So again, it will open here. And now if you want to download this coral ribs, you just need to click here to download option. So you can able to download this coral rib for the whole globe. So now it is start downloading. So this data is already downloaded. So you can go to drive where we have kept our data so now you can just right click and you can extract it okay so i have already extracted here so once you will extract this coral ribs you will get this kind of data here okay so we'll get the resource in that resource you will get this pdf file and this is the map for this okay so again you can open the this pdf file So you can read the more information about this paper is given there. Okay. So this way, very easily you can able to download it. So now let, suppose you want to extract it with your study area. Okay. This is an coral reef and I'm interested to extract with my study area. 
So you can able to add your study area here. Okay. Like I will add this study area. So after adding study area, we can hollow this. And now if you want to clip with your study area, okay. Suppose you want to clip this portion with your study area. So if raster data is there, then we are extracting, but when there is a vector to vector data, we are using clip. So just click on the arc toolbox. There is an analysis tool and extract option is there and clip option is there. Okay. Clip. So just add this file. That is a global mangrove. Okay. And in the clip feature, we need to add our study area and output feature means where you want to save this clip file that output location we need to provide. So just add a study area and so I will save here clip mangrove. Okay. Just save and just click on okay. So now this portion is successfully clipped. Let I will uncheck the remaining portion. So this way very easily we can able to clip mangroves from whole globe data. Okay. So you can clip same with the coral reef data and other data. So if you are having any doubts, you can ask me in the comment sections. And if you're interested to download any other data set, so there are different, different data sets is available. You can able to download the data sets. Okay. So, so many data is there. So if you want to download the mean annual sea surface temperature that you can able to download. So many data is available there. If you're interested, you can go with this. If you have any doubts, you can ask me in the comment sections. Our telegram group link is given in the description box. You can join it. Thank you.